It's your boy Rick Mohammed, Broadway Sports Media in the building, live in my associates, 3kingsboxing.com. PBC show going off tomorrow night here at the Minnesota Armory, if you will. And I got my man fighting. He's 10 and 0. Nine, is it nine knockouts, money? Six, 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 six knockouts. I'm getting, well, he wish it was That's nine. We working on it, right? Yeah. Money Pal, he's 10 and 0 with six knockouts. And he got a, a hell of a test ahead of him tomorrow night as he takes on Devin Alexander's brother, uh, 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 Von Pop. I mean, Von, Von Alexander. That's going to be a tough test for you, man. Yes, what, what did you think when they offered you this fight? Oh, I was happy. I was really happy because I get the chance now to finally show people that uh, I am the real deal. We train really, really hard, man. I always listen to my coach. I listen to my dad and my parents. I've got good people that's around me. And they always they always do what they tell me and they do what's best for me. And I trust them and all the wisdom and the, the, the time they put into me, it won't go to waste. And more, most importantly, I always you know, keep God first. And I know I'm right spiritually and I, I feel good. I'm, I'm happy to be here. I'm just happy to be, listen, just to be here today to be able to do what I love to do is a blessing in itself. I, am, I embrace every moment with nothing but joy and happiness. I'm just glad to be here. Wow, and I can hear that in his voice. And, and, and I'm glad you put God first because we're nothing without him and everything because of him. Yes, sir. We wouldn't have this, this not, talent nothing. if it you wasn't take him. It away just like that, Absolutely. And the fact that you have good people in your circle. Yes. And the key word that you mentioned is trust. Trust is everything in a team, yes, sir. in an organization. That trust, that trust fails and breaks down, that machine stops yes. to a team. 100%. You have to remember that you can't do anything by yourself. Even people say, I got this on my own, I did this on my own. Everybody needs somebody. And to make it to the top within anything, not just boxing alone, you have to have people around you that have your best interests in mind. They're always going to look out. They're not going to tell you what you want to hear. They're going to tell you what you need to hear. Exactly. And so you have to also stay grounded and open-minded because that's how you're going to get to the top. There's going to be a lot of people that come around you and tell you this or that. But how old are you? I'm 21 years old. Y'all hear this? He's 21 years old. You hear what this guy is saying. Is, is the, the, the people coming around, they, they go, his team is going to tell him what he needs to hear, not yes. what he wants to hear. Yes. That's cheerleading. You don't need cheerleading. You no, need sir. the truth in this business. Yes, sir. Because this is why guys put their lives on the line every time they step in the ring and lace those gloves on. Yes, sir. Rest in peace, my man, Max. Sorry. It happened. That yeah, was very sad to see that because I actually watched that fight live. Yes. Nobody wants to ever see that happen. Ever. Even when I get in a ring and fight, man, I, I don't wish no harm upon my on my opponent like some long term stuff like that. Yeah. Even though we're in there fighting, yeah, we're fighting. I, and Bob, I'm trying to hurt you for that second, but right after that bell rings, like, back to normal. Yes. Man. I don't want no. It's just business it's at just the time. Business, man. Absolutely. It's business. And you don't want to. You have to remember that's still somebody's brother, somebody's son, son father. Yeah. And so you guys have to. People don't sometimes. You know, remember that even though we're fighters, we're still people. Absolutely. You know what I mean? We still have emotions. And uh -huh. when somebody sadly loses their life and something like this, it, it's really heartbreaking. It's hard to see because you don't ever want to see it. That's what I try to tell everybody. It's still people, and that's why I do. Broadway Sports Media, we don't just do guys already on that level, hit that pinnacle, they got straps. We want the prospect. You're the future of boxing, man. And he's a person. He's a normal person, guy. He just that. he just gets paid money to go in the ring like a gladiator and a warrior. Real quick, I'm gonna show you real quick. What's your favorite junk food? Pepperoni pizza from Pizza Hut. I love it, man. What's your favorite? What's your favorite movie, buddy? Um, oh man, there's so many. Shoot, uh, I, I love Napoleon Dynamite. I'm a big Jurassic Park fan. I love dinosaurs. Man. Um, Dang, Friday, that's a classic. Shoot, a whole bunch of stuff come on BT, man. I can just keep running ah. down. It's hard, man. Last, last hard. but not least, when you're not training and yes. you're not preparing for a fight, what does Money Power like to do? You're 21 years old. Tell them what you do for fun. What I do for fun is uh, most of the time I just hang out with my girlfriend. She's my best friend, so she always uh, keeps me grounded. And we... Brownie points, girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, man, she always keeps me grounded. She's, she's awesome, and I hang out with my family, my siblings, and okay. my friends and stuff like that, and uh, eat pizza. Much respect, man. We're going to be cheering for you tomorrow night. I'm Rick Mohammed, Brawler Sports Media. Look at the camera, tell these guys your name, and that they're watching Brawler Sports Media. Right now. My name is Money Pal the Fourth, and you're watching Brawler Sports Media. My man. Much respect to you Thank tomorrow you, night. Man. Looking forward to a good show. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. I'm Rick Mohammed, Brawler Sports Media. My associates, Three Kings Boxing, Money Pal, about to do his thing 10 0, 6 KOs, taking on Von Alexander, right here at Minnesota Army. At the, at the PBC show itself, you heard what he said. He, he's getting closer and closer to that, that platform he wants to be on. Much respect, baby. Thank you so much. Don't go nowhere. We, we'll be back with more.